Darwin Nunes joined Liverpool from Benfica for a club record £85 million. The Uruguay forward has signed a six-year contract at Anfield. The 22-year-old scored 34 times for the Portuguese side in all competitions last season. The 22-year-old scored 34 times for Benfica in all competitions last season, including goals in both legs of the club's Champions League quarter-final defeat to Liverpool in April. Despite his success in Europe, however, it wasn't always plain sailing for him and his family who struggled to make ends meet when he was young, but the 22-year-old has remained humble about his roots. Yes, I went to bed lonely on an empty stomach, Nunez said in an interview via Marca, but one who went to bed with an empty stomach the most was my mother. She made sure my brother and I ate first. My mum used to go to bed without joining us to eat. I will never forget where I come from. Nunez then fought for his future and his family's when he was approached by one of Uruguay's top clubs, Penarol, in 2013, but he suffered a setback at 14 after the club didn't sign him and he returned home to live with his parents. At 16, he tore his cruciate ligaments and was out of action for a year and a half before his Penarol coach, Leo Ramos, handed him his first team sheet debut. Despite not having much success back at home following his injury, he managed to break through in Europe at Almeria. That was when he went from nothing to making a name for himself, established himself as one of the finest strikers in Europe and is now expected to earn around £120,000 a week at Liverpool. But still, I don't want to forget where I come from, a humble, hard-working family, Nunez said. My father worked eight or nine hours in construction to buy us what we needed and to eat. My mother was always a housewife and would go out on the streets to collect bottles to sell. Benfica boss Nelson Verissimo hailed the youngster's development during his brief spell at the club. His growth this season is rising interest from several clubs. We have to accept it. It's the law of the market. Players like Darwin are good to keep, but we are in a competitive market where clubs need the money for their daily management. The last season, he became the youngest player to score in a Champions League game at just 22 years and 264 days old.